Hey everyone, welcome back. If you've ever wanted to customize your keyboard shortcuts on TradingView to speed up your workflow, this full guide is exactly what you need. Whether you're new to the platform or looking to work more efficiently on your charts, today I'm going to show you how to access all of TradingView's keyboard shortcuts, and I'll clarify an important limitation that may save you some time and frustration. By the end, you'll know exactly what you can and can't do with shortcuts in TradingView, so you can set your expectations and work around any limitations with confidence. Let's get right into it. First things first, go ahead and open up TradingView in your browser. If you're not already logged in, just sign in with your account so you have access to all the features. TradingView is a powerful platform for charting, analyzing, and even trading, but sometimes their interface can feel a little overwhelming, so I'll walk you through each step. Next, look at the top of the screen. You'll see a menu labeled Products. Give that a click. This menu lets you explore all the different tools TradingView offers, and it's a good reminder of how much this platform packs under the hood. Now up in the very top left corner, right near the TradingView logo, you should see your profile icon. Click on that. When you click your profile icon, you're opening a panel that's all about your personal settings and preferences, kind of like the control room for your TradingView experience. From here, go ahead and look for the option labeled Keyboard Shortcuts. Click into that. This section is incredibly useful because it shows you a well-organized list of all the keyboard shortcuts available on TradingView. If you're like me, sometimes you just want a quick way to zoom in, add a line, or open an indicator, and this is where you'll see exactly what key combination does what. Even if you're not a shortcut pro yet, just taking a look here can give you a good sense of the platform's possibilities. But in here, where it gets a little tricky, you might be hoping to actually change or personalize these shortcuts to suit your habits, maybe to match other platforms you're familiar with. Unfortunately, as of now, TradingView doesn't let users modify or edit these keyboard shortcuts. If you try to click on a shortcut to change it, or press another key to swap it out, TradingView just doesn't allow any changes. It's a common wish, I've definitely wished for this myself, but at the moment, what you see is what you get. So don't worry if you're clicking and nothing happens, it's not your computer or your account, that's just how the platform is designed right now. I know this limitation can be disappointing if you were hoping for full customization, but it's important to know up front, so you don't waste time looking for hidden options or wondering if you've missed something. Instead, I recommend taking a few minutes to familiarize yourself with the existing shortcuts. Sometimes, just memorizing the main ones you'll use daily can make your workflow so much faster. Alright, that's the full walkthrough. If you found this guide helpful, hit that like button, it really helps the channel out. Drop a comment below if you have any questions about TradingView or if you'd like to see a tutorial on another feature. Don't forget to subscribe if you want more clear, practical tutorials like this one. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.